G.I. Joe is there. G.I. Joe. G.I. Joe is there. It's G.I. Joe against Cobra the enemy, fighting to save the day. He never gives up, he's always there, fighting for freedom over land and air. G.I. Joe. Joe is the code name for America's daring, highly trained special mission force. Its purpose? To defend human freedom against Cobra, a ruthless terrorist organization determined to rule the world. He never gives up, he'll stay till the fight's won. G.I. Joe will dare. G.I. Joe will dare. G.I. Joe will dare. G.I. Joe will from Apple Butter. Uh, Fendi, we seek twin brothers riding vehicles similar to ours. There, to the south. They ride that way. Our gratitude, Fendi. Me and the camel jockey got a lot in common. He loves the desert, same as I do. Duke, look! It's them, all right. Let's go! G.I. Joe in hot pursuit! Shoot! I was hoping they'd try something! Remember, aim for their tires! Duke, we got company! Not company, competition! The October Guard! Who are they? The Russian version of G.I. Joe, an elite combat force! Yeah, Roosties! Next to a toothache, there's nothing I hate more than a Roostie! Duke, we gotta turn back! That dune ahead! What about it? It's not a dune! It's a Cobra truck! Yeah, and we're outgunned. Badly. So? Let's take them! There's a difference between courage and stupidity! Retreat! We might be in a little trouble here. Just cause we're out number 20 to 1? Moderation, gentlemen. We mustn't kill them all. Now what? It's the October Guard. I knew it. Those sneaky Russian rats trying to get us while our backs are turned. No, they're shooting at Cobra. They're helping us. They're helping themselves. Cobra's their enemy, too. What is that? Whatever they are, I hope they're on our side. Ain't that something? They sure are. But what? Hold your fire! Oh, 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 oh. Holy! Hear me well, men of Earth. I shall speak but once. We have taken two specimens for examination. When we conclude our experiments, your planet will be informed of its fate. Hold it! Who are you? Where are you from? Our world circles the star Sirius. I wouldn't care to be one of those twins. And imagine taking Zemo and Tomax's examples of humanity. Colonel Sharp's gonna have our heads. He sends us out to nab Zamont and Tomax, and what are we going back with? A story even I don't believe. On the other hand, the trip doesn't have to be a total loss. I do not think the American likes us. Good! I am not liking him. He is ugly. You say what I think you said? 
Sergeant Horshaw! <sighs> Doc Colonel! So, you're Colonel Brekoff. At your service. And you are? Call me Duke. Looks like we've got a situation here, Colonel. Da. Our orders do not cover an encounter with you. Ditto. Well, we could walk away and pretend it didn't happen. Da, comrade, I agree. But just gonna let them go? That's exactly what we're gonna do. Do svidanya. There'll be another time, you dumb Russian bear. <laughs> ugly, ugly. Within the last 24 hours, these strange craft have attacked the Russian oil refinery, American airfield, an American tanker, a Russian observatory, and part of the Alaska pipeline. They're already squabbling like cats and dogs at the United Nations. The Soviet people will not tolerate these unprovoked attacks by the American imperialists. Your government is behind this outrage, Mr. Ambassador, and the United States will not stand for it. Nor will the proud Soviet Republic bow to imperialist threats. They sound like gung-ho in that guy horror show. So, we've got a crisis on our hands. And unless the matter is resolved... We get the idea, Colonel Sharp. On orders from the President, you're to drop everything else and find these flying saucers. Colonel, I have a plan. Do you think the Navy could lend us a submarine? How we doing, Cutter? About to go under the ice cap. So, we're gonna bust into the October Guards headquarters, huh? Only instead of fighting, we're gonna talk? Maybe the Russians have information we don't... And you think they're gonna share it? Duke, can I interest you in some oceanfront land in Missouri? Better get ready, troops. We're here. <sighs> so we are, but where's here? The rim of an ice crater in Siberia. It's ringed with radar and anti-aircraft defenses. The October Guard is inside, below the ice wall. How are we gonna get in? Knock and see we're the welcome wagon? Ever been to the circus, gung-ho? Ever seen a human cannonball? Uh-oh, uh, now wait a minute, not me, pal. You're not shooting this leatherneck out of some cannon. It's the only way to get past their defenses. Now, let's go! G.I. Joe. Our mission here is peaceful, Colonel Brekhoff. Say nothing! You will wait in the stockade until we notify the Kremlin. <laughs> then we shoot you. Inside, ugly. If you didn't have that gun, you dumb Russian bear. You think I need gun? Like I said, dumb! American ski devil, release me! Stop! Stop! The fight's over! As of now! Colonel, I believe this is yours. Duke, you crazy? I told you, we came on a mission of peace. I meant it. Perhaps we should talk. 
Soviet intelligence knows nothing more about these spacemen than you do, Sergeant. But if we combine forces, we might discover what they want and how to beat them. Yeah, it'll be real cozy. Just don't stick me with that dumb Russian bear. That's exactly who you are teaming with, gung-ho. What? I'm not letting either one of you yahoos out of my sight. There's too much at stake. You're on my squad. So's Harsho. That's final. And they'll make up the rest of our team. Put her there, partner. Name is Wong. You're Snake Eyes, right? Dusty, Stormovic, Barbecue, and Dinah will be my squad. My group will scout for the saucers over Eastern Europe. And mine over North America. Move out! Can't you turn that thing off? I'm trying to get some set time. It is my duty to monitor the world's broadcast. And always Harsha does his duty. I'll push your duty up your nose. Uh, quiet, ugly. Something strange. Listen well, people of Earth, or I shall not repeat myself. I am broadcasting from the moon. In exactly 24 hours, I shall destroy two of your cities. San Francisco in the United States and Vladivostok in Russia. This will be your only warning. Surrender unconditionally to me or I shall destroy all your cities. Next to that clown, even Cobra looks tame. Calling Joe, Unit Alpha. We read you, Colonel Sharp. The President is taking the aliens' threat seriously, Duke. The Air Force is scrambling all available aircraft. The Army is mobilizing, and the Navy is recalling ships from all over the globe. All heading for San Francisco, Colonel? You got it, Duke. We hear that the Russians are busy, too. Massing their forces at Vladivostok. Any orders for us? Not yet. Just stand by and be ready to jump. In any direction. Jump? Over this ear building? Ain't we done enough falling for one day? When I reckon we have. And. Ah! Holy jumping Jehoshaphat! What is that? Whatever it is, it's flying a G.I. Joe glider. Bring it down! Tarnation! about giving a man a hand up, eh? We'll give you something, all right. Ah, uh, thanks a heap, pard. Drop your weapons! Outside the cage! Reckon we ain't got much choice. Looky who's a coming! Last time I see you, polecats, you were getting pulled into flying saucer. We cut a deal with the alien. Lower the cage. Step out. What you all got in mind for us? A close encounter. Painfully close. Put them on the tables. Return to your post. Well, come. I see you've brought me fresh specimens. Yes. I should learn much from examining these two. G.I. Joe will return after these messages. Now, back to G.I. Joe. Your friends, the Joe team and the October Guard, where are they? What do you care, you... Buckeyed owl hoot. I would not wish them to interfere, FND. With Cobra's battle plan. I'll be dang busted. Certain. Yeah, and this I 
no flying saucer neither, Sport. It's a Cobra airship, that's what. Right, made up to look like a bloody saucer. I don't savvy. Why all this here play acting? Kill them, Zartan. Yeah, it ain't like they'll live long enough to pass it on. Return to your posts. Saucer 2 calling Saucer 1. Come in, Saucer 1. Answer me. Saucer 1 here, Cobra Commander. Zartan, what have you learned from the captives? Enough. They were suitably startled to learn my true identity. So we may conclude that neither G.I. Joe nor the October God suspects the truth. Excellent. Then both of the so-called superpowers have fallen for our trick. The Russians have concentrated their military forces in Vladivostok, and the American forces are massed in San Francisco. Leaving the Kremlin and the White House completely undefended. Lovely. Yes. And our troops are quietly surrounding both places, disguised as tourists and ordinary motorists. At 1800 hours, I shall order them to attack. And by 1900 hours, Cobra will own the White House and the Kremlin. And the military secrets of both nations will be ours for the taking. Exactly. Proceed according to plan, Sartan. Saucer 2 out. So, now you know. Which means, of course, you must perish. Any last words? No! Oh! 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 oh. We got to warn your people and my people. You figure out how to fly this dingus while I get on the TV. Sergeant Duke, come quick. Message from Comrade Wong. Savvy? It's Cobra Fakeroo. Forget Frisco and Vladivostok. Hightail it for Washington, D.C. and Moscow. Pronto! Say we do, and it turns out to be a Russian Fakeroo. It's not. And there's your proof. Get word to the pilot. Top speed to Washington. Move. Radio Brekhoff, tell him to head for Moscow. And call Joe headquarters for reinforcements. Eighteen hundred hours. Attack! Cobra! Joseph! Duke, 
Up there! Am I seeing things? Yeah! You will suffer for this! They're dogfighting! Still one thing I don't get. How the heck did Snake Eyes get wise to Cobra's scheme? I am broadcasting from the moon. In exactly 24 hours, I shall destroy two of your cities. Well, son of a gun, a milk carton and a human hand. Two things you don't find many of on the moon, huh? Hey, Gung Ho! How come Snake Eyes getting all the brains and you're getting all the ugly? Uh, hot that, son of... <laughs> it's time we headed home. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I still say you're a dumb Russian bear. <laughs> <laughs> Ugly! <laughs> yeah! 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 Joe will return after these messages.